Thank you, KC. What a great time to be alive. At JetBlue, we take pride in bringing humanity back to air travel. Over the past 20 years, disruption has been part of our DNA, and we've expanded to over 150 destinations across three continents, and today, we're an integrated travel company with subsidiaries in ventures, but also in travel products. Scalable growth to carry 30 million passengers on an annual basis on 1,000 flights every single day is a core competitive advantage at JetBlue. In order to fuel this growth, JetBlue is at the forefront of innovation. Because we are concentrated in the world's busiest airspace, the New York City area, to solve for the complex nature of real-time operations and layers of access to information in such a complex environment, we do need a lake house as provided by the Databricks in order to fuel this growth with the kinds of complexities of data that we have available. Over the past two years, JetBlue has made great investments in enterprise data science and AI and ML. Databricks offer scalability, flexibility, and go-to-market efficiency for all of our complex use cases and products that we aim to ship out. Quarterly product prioritization is done at the C-suite level, and data teams are structured to accelerate use cases along the data value chain. So we take great pride in identifying use cases along the data value chain in order to accelerate it all the way to AI and ML, regardless of where the use cases are. Data refinement along the data value chain is unlocked, uh, unlocks value from insights. Raw data is continuously hydrated, meshed, and refined by our data integrations and data engineering team to create reliable pipelines in the lake house across various SLAs, regardless of what the use case is. The business intelligence and the data science team deploy the ML models using such pipelines in order to accelerate the, the go-to-market efficiency as well as the deployment of our products. The Databricks Lake House is an all-encompassing platform that fits like a hand and glove on our data value chain. Role-based governance using Unity Catalog is able to provide our various teams with great flexibility and governance at the same time to serve the right documents and the right insights to the right folks across the organization. Our business intelligence team is focused on building real-time dashboards for KPI reporting and business decisions. Our operations data science team focuses on cost efficiency products, including the real-time digital twin that we'll be talking about. And the commercial data science team focuses on revenue growth products, such as dynamic pricing, recommendation engines, and so on and so forth. The AI and ML engineering team is our pincer movement, or rather scouts in a battle, where they're constantly looking at the next use case to get 20% of the work done, before handing it off to the respective data science team to take it through the whole deployment pattern and completion. They also maintain our internally developed AutoML and AutoDeploy library called BlueML, which is completely built on the open source framework um, built by uh, Databricks. And the, we also maintain MLOps capabilities within the AI and ML team. A great example of applying the data value chain to real-time digital twin simulator within JetBlue is our newest product, Blue Sky. It is a product that we built from scratch internally using hundreds of, hundreds of attributes about each and every flight that you would take at any given point in time. And we build a continually refreshed network in real time with an embedded LLM for user-friendly decision augmentation recommendations by our frontline staff. The real-time components are then cascaded and optimized to solve this multidimensional problem. Blue Sky is an ecosystem of AI and ML models with near real-time and real-time capabilities, including simulation capabilities before a decision is actually taken for the next 24 to 48 hours of our, the state of our operations. An, NL, an LLM built on top of that supercharges the product go-to-market strategy because we're able to make decisions with less clicks to decision ratio. At JetBlue, we started our generative AI journey using, in general, an FAQ chatbot using technologies such as OpenAI, Dolly 2.0, Hugging Face, Langchain, and even MPT from Mosaic. And congrats on that, by the way. 
Dolly and LLM Ops through Databricks offers incredible LLM governance framework for our internal chatbot creations. A framework for easy LLM integration is built into every product, and it also is integrated into our existing communications platform like Microsoft Teams that our users are you know, familiar with. So on the left-hand side, you'll see our, our BlueBot, which basically goes through a line of questioning regardless of what the user is. And on the right-hand side, you'll see the same chatbot integrated into a native Teams platform for our frontline staff. Junity Catalog provides role-based access to documents, and it's incredibly powerful to us because if a new employee is accessing the chatbot, they'll only be served some of the FAQ questions from our employee handbook. But if someone from finance is accessing the same chatbot, they'd be given access to some of the 10Ks and 10Qs, including some of the SAP data that they have access to. If an operational frontline staff is accessing the same chatbot, they're, they can then access the real-time predictions made by a digital twin solution to simulate all of the different uh, scenarios before we actually execute a decision. So this open source generative AI framework embraced by Databricks and thus by us in return brings our crew members much closer to the data and insights with little change management required. Generative AI distribute, is distributed at JetBlue across various phases and use cases, from FAQ chatbots to digital twin integration to role-based access into every product that we ship out, as well as now new revenue channels that we're exploring for open source LLMs where customers can create trips by planning better as well as book directly from the chatbots. And we are working right now on an aviation GPT fine-tuned industrial chatbot, which will provide our technical operations teams with WebMD-style diagnosis capabilities for each and every aircraft. So we are incredibly proud of all of the work that we're doing, and thanks to the great partnership with Databricks for achieving you know, what we have so far. We are hiring across the entire gamut, so come join our flight. Thank you.